Hi guys, morning. Welcome to the channel. So, today Paige is feeling sick. She's going for her hair thing soon and she'll probably be vlogging that, but if her voice sounds like sandpaper, that will be why. <laughs> she is going to do hair modeling thing today because she's modeling for an apprentice oh, just down the street. I'm staying behind and doing assignment because I'm really behind. <laughs> she still wants to film today. Alright, we'll see you guys in the rest of the video if I'm in it, but we'll see. Alright, see you there. As you can tell by my voice, I'm very sick. Um, that's why I got Phil to do my intro today. Um, if you guys don't know, Phil is my boyfriend. I'm going makeup free this morning just because, quite frankly, I cannot be bothered to put anything on. Um, I've put a little bit of mascara on my top eyelashes and I might put some on my bottom in a second, but I just thought I'd show you guys my outfit just before I leave. Um, excuse the messy floor. One of the things I need to do today is actually clean the bedroom. Top on here, just a stripy top with a tie in the front. Um, this is just from Supre. Um, I bought it like a couple years ago, I think. Um, just have my Kmart high-waisted jeans, my little hand heel boots that were gifted to me by one of my old workmates, and then I've just got my Ben Sherman coat that was gifted to me by my beauty therapist. So... Really simple today. It's like 20 past 10 now. I'm doing the hair modeling thing. I'm actually getting my hair cut and it's for one of our assessments. Um, and that's at 10.30. So I'm going to leave now because I'm going to walk down. It's probably like a five minute walk. So I'm not too worried. I wanted to film today because I've been looking forward to filming today like the whole week. And I've got quite a bit that I actually need to do today. So I really wanted to bring you guys along. But yeah, I've just had like a really sore throat like the last two days. And now I feel like all flimmy like through here and up in my head. But I mean, that's just how life works, isn't it? You're not 100% all of the time. So for those of you that are new that are watching this, I don't normally sound like this. <laughs> it is what it is, you know? But I need to leave now. So yep, yeah, I'll catch you guys when I actually get there. This is where I'm going in here. <laughs> Well, this truck is middle of the road, reversing who knows where. He like had his indicator on to go right, and then it's like in the middle of this traffic, and then decides, oh, actually no, I'm just gonna reverse in the middle of ongoing traffic. Makes sense. Wow. Now we got now we got a red. Um. Yep. No. That's... Oh my gosh, drivers today! What the hell? Oh my gosh. Hi guys, so it's a little bit later on now. I got my hair cut, it's a little bit shorter, um, and we just kind of like tidied up the layers a little bit because, maybe back a bit, because her assessment was on the layers. I really like the length, um, and I think I'm just going to continue to grow it um, a little bit more. Oh. That was an ambulance. I hope whoever's they got into is okay. Just dropped Phil off at his course. The time is like 10 to 1 and as you may be able to see by this in the background, I am just at the supermarket now because um, we have a staff meeting later on for my work and it's at my house. So I thought I would come and just pick up like a few snacks and stuff for everybody just so they can kind of like munch and stuff as we're having the staff meeting. Um, we are going to go and get pizza like as the actual dinner but so yeah that's why I'm kind of stopped off here. So I changed my top because I wasn't feeling the other top. This lady just like full on walked past my car and like had my camera up. So fun. Anyways, let's go and get snacks. In here I've got the washing machine and the dishwasher on but I thought I would show you guys what I got from the supermarket so I have my trusty new world reusable bag so if anyone's wondering I just got a new world and get groceries so I got some of these bluebird thinly cut sour cream and chives chips they didn't have the normal crinkle cut ones of those so I, I just got the thin cut ones. I got some bluebird salt and vinegar crinkle cut chips. Got some of these, the natural sour squirms lollies because 
Hopefully you guys can actually hear me. Um, but we've had these at work before and they seem to go down really well. So I thought I'd just get some of those. The last thing I actually bought for the staff meeting was some of these. So these are just the Pascal's pineapple lumps. Um, these are like a Kiwi classic and I just kind of wanted something chocolatey. I wasn't really sure what to get so I just thought I'd go with these. last thing that I got was some Griffin's Mint Treat Mint Chocolate Biscuits for myself because we've ran out of these and I really, really like them. I got all of this stuff for about $13. I have a love-hate relationship with my hair. Like, it's just, some days I just want to shave it all off and other days I really, really like it. I think half of it's probably my skin and just the fact this is like bright orange. Anyways, just kind of thought I'd come on here and just kind of update you guys a little bit um, on what's been happening over the past week because I didn't vlog last week. Um, last week I was still actually really, really sick and I was on my period as well. And I had the worst period that I think I've had in so, so long. Like, I had really, really bad cramps. I had really, really bad headaches. Like, I had a hot water bottle on my stomach, like, most of the time. And I kind of just relaxed at home on my days off. So I didn't really vlog. The only day I did kind of do stuff was when I finished off my winter lookbook video which will be up by the time you guys watch this so I'll link that down below if you haven't seen it. Me and Phil and I went out for lunch that day at my work um, but other than that like I've literally just been working and sick for like the past week. Um, the only thing I did kind of film last week was a grocery haul because we did like quite a big one. I'll put that in now for you guys. Just got back from grocery shopping so I guess we'll start over this side and just work the way down so we got some more toilet paper so we just got the cotton softs 12 pack got some more cocoa pops because we're running low so these ones are just the kellogg's um 650 grams um they're on special so that's why i got those got a bottle of wine for tonight um just because i kind of want to have a bottle of wine with dinner so this one is the jacobs creek Moscato Rosé. Um, Phil said this is really really sweet um, and he knows that I like sweet alcoholic drinks so I'll keep you guys updated on whether or not I like it but I really like the packaging. I think it's really cute. Um, I got some more vitamins because I'm running low. Um, I've talked about these before in a previous favourites video. Doesn't want to focus because it's focusing on the ice cream. These ones are just the Healthery's Vitamin C 500 grams. Just like the orange flavour. Got some more ice cream again i've talked about this before in favorites videos and i've bought it in previous videos as well um this is just the much more premium awesome chocolate cookies and fudge ice cream which this company that they make all this stuff here in new zealand so i love supporting a local company it's got three loaves of the value white toast bread uh, they're just a dollar each got some more porterhouse steak um just because it's quite cheap so love that um, we got some more lettuce, some bananas, uh, we got some coffee for Phil, so he's trying this one because they didn't have his normal one, um, so this is just the international roast coffee powder, there's hoons outside. Got a couple of packs of biscuits because these ones were like $2 each, so we just got the Griffin's Afghans and then the Griffin's um, chocolate mint treats which if you guys have been on my channel for a while you know they're my absolute favourite. Some more Panadol because it's that time of the month and I am not dealing with it well this month. I always get the ones with the Optizorb formula because I find they're stronger than normal Panadols. Got two sauces so one of them is from Watties, it's just a sweet and sour sauce and then we've got the Greg's smoked hickory. Two milks at the back just the value milk um three liter and a two liter because we always go through two a week some more chicken tenders these are just the pam's southern style chicken tenders they're really great for like toasties or to go with mash or just in sandwiches and stuff got some more cheese um so this one is just the meadow fresh colby because it was on special got some more pads just some more liners as you guys know if you have watched any of my empties videos i get the u by kotex ones because they're really comfy and like i said it's that time of the month so yeah i've got like a pack of my normal ones but i just needed some more of those and they're on special so that's good timing um and then the last couple of things that we got were just some washing bits so just some Purcell Ultimate um, washing powder. I always get this. It's really, really good. Um, and then I just got another like wool detergent. So I just got the cuddly, soft and sensitive um, fabric conditioner stuff. This is kind of like a big shop for us this week. All of this came to just over $100. So 
that's really good and a lot of it was on special this week so we kind of see on groceries we kind of just need like a few bits and pieces this week so i think the rest of the plans for today are i need to upload my winter lookbook video i literally think it might be my most favorite video that i've ever put up on my channel it's definitely my favorite kind of like fashiony type video that I've ever put up. Yeah, I'm really really excited for that to go up because I know it's going to do really really well. I just had so much fun filming it with Phil and editing it so I definitely want to do more of those. Probably like the last few hours I just need to clean up the entire house because like I said before we're having the staff meeting at my house um, and that starts at five but my manager's coming over a little bit earlier um, and she's picking up some people as well um, just to help me like kind of set up and everything for it. That's pretty much all this vlog is going to be. I'll kind of show you guys some like befores and afters because again I've done like a whole cleaning thing in one of my other vlogs that I've done so if you didn't see that vlog um, I'll link that down below as well for you. I do want to do like a clean with me but because I'm really sick at the moment like you can probably tell in my voice um, I kind of just want to take it easy and try and actually let my body not take on so much at one time because I feel like if I'm not working at my day job I'm either on here like I'm either vlogging or I'm doing videos or I'm editing videos or I'm at my job in the evening as well like there is not a lot of time that I just sit down and do nothing I think I'm just gonna put all of these away in the cupboard upload my video and then have some lunch I think these I'm going to crack into while I'm uploading my video. Light's not going to help with showing you guys this. But I made this thumbnail last night and I'm so, so stoked with it. Um, if anyone is wondering how I make my thumbnails, I just use Pixlr. I am going to do like a whole video on how I actually edit my videos and thumbnails and stuff. I am so stoked with how it's come out. So I'm just starting to upload it now, but because we have five, it uploads so fast. So we get to write the description and the tags. So I've just uploaded my new video, my winter lookbook video. Um, I'm so excited for you guys to see this. Like I showed Phil last night and oh my gosh, I was just obsessed with it. Um, so now I'm just about to go and share it all. But yeah, if you haven't seen it, I'll link it down below for you. Now that my video is all shared and everything, I'm still trying to work out how to post a picture from my desktop onto Instagram. I'm such an old person, like I don't know how to do that. So I've been trying to work that out for like the last probably like, what, 20 minutes, half an hour? But I still haven't figured it out. So... <laughs> I think I'm just going to make a start on all the cleaning and stuff and get that done first because um, that's actually more important right now and then if I get stuck I can always ask Phil when he gets home. So I guess kind of everything I have to do is I kind of want to clean up the desk a little bit because it's kind of messy. I need to put the clothes away on this chair. and My battery is running low. Hold on, just let me change it. Right, so you're back to the chair. I need to put these clothes away. I've just put the heater on so that I can kind of warm up the place a little bit. Um, I want to spray and wipe the bottom of those. If I can, I kind of want to clean the bar cart. kind of want to wipe down the coffee table and vac the couch. I need to vac the floor in here as well, especially around by the washing machine because it always gets like lots of drops of stuff. Um, probably clean that mirror. Hello. I'm going to hang those towels outside on the little era thing that we've got going um, and probably get another load on. I need to empty the dishwasher because that's done. Put everything like all of these on the bench away. I need to clean the chopping boards, wipe down the actual bench, wipe down that bench. I need to make the bed and I need to change the sheets. I need to sort all those clothes. I really need to wipe down my dressing table because it's really disgusting and probably the bedside table as well. Um, and then in the bathroom, this is the room that needs it the most because this mirror is disgusting. To clean that, clean the basin. If I can, I'm gonna try and clean the shower. I need to empty the bin, put away my hair dryer, and clean the toilet. Oh, I look blue. Why do I look blue? It's just after 2.30, so everyone's coming at 5, so I've kind of got that amount of time to pretty much clean my entire place. Um, and I want to vac the floor and the bedroom as well, so we'll see how much I can get done.
four o'clock and I think my manager and some of the girls are coming at like 4.30 so <laughs> that's quite soon. Um, I've pretty much finished everything so we'll start off over here. So I have, when I want to focus, I've wiped down the coffee table, vacked all the floors, I've put away the clothes that are up there. I've hung the towels out. I've now got some sheets in there. Um, I've wiped down the bar cart because that gets dusty really, really quickly and because it's glass, like it's really obvious. Um, I wiped the bottom of the bar stools so now they're all shiny. I'm waiting for Phil to get home so I can take the bins out. I've wiped down the bench and put away everything except for the laptop, which I'm going to kind of keep open. Um, I do still have the chopping boards in the sink. I've vacked the floor in here. I cleaned the bin because that looked pretty gross. I've made the bed in here. I'm still yet to wipe down the bedside table and the dresser, so that's what I'm going to try and tackle next. Um, I've put the clothes away. Then in the bathroom, I'm not going to clean the shower just because I feel like it's not too bad at the moment but I have organized all of the shower gels also I did want to share with you guys I bought a new shower gel from Lush is this one here it's just the sex bomb shower gel and me and Phil have been really liking it um, at the moment because we've both been using it I've cleaned the mirror hello which was really disgusting like especially around here clean the basin wiped this thing because this thing gets dirty really really easily Cleaned the bin and emptied that, restocked the towels, restocked the toilet paper, and I've cleaned the toilet, and I've vacked in here as well, um, and I've vacked the little mat, because, again, that shows up any kind of, like, excess toilet paper or whatever really, really fast. So I know I said I wasn't going to film it, but I did <laughs> decide to film bits and pieces. Not the whole lot, but little bits and pieces. I cleaned this mirror as well, because that's looking pretty gross. Same with this one, um, but I do still have the dishwasher to empty and I still have to vac the floor in here as well. Like half an hour until everybody, well until my manager arrives at least, um, with some of the girls and I still want to get all the snacks and stuff out. I'm probably just going to keep cleaning for as much as I can. I'll probably start with the mirror in the other room and then probably come in here. So I've just cleaned the mirror and I've also just cleaned up the desk. I feel so puffed. It's like 20 past 4, so they'll be here soon. I've literally done everything that I need to do in here. So I've cleaned this mirror. I've actually cleaned this mirror too because that was disgusting. I've wiped my dressing table. I haven't done my makeup caddy over there, but honestly I do not have time for that. I've cleaned this mirror here, and I've wiped the bedside table, and I have vacked the floors. The only thing to do now other than the dishwasher is to get all the snacks and stuff set up for when people arrive. So Phil's home here is just taking the bins out so I've got all the snacks that I brought so I've got the sour worms, the pineapple lumps, some vinegar chips and the sour cream and chives. So I just put the chips into these bigger bowls because we don't really have anything else fancy but I do like the way the lollies look in those. Phil's got a candle burning over there so that it doesn't smell like chemicals but it's like half for now. I think my manager and a few of the people that she's picking up will be here any minute. So yeah, pretty excited. I'm just happy I got all the cleaning done. Like there's literally nothing else I wanted to clean. So it is a lot later now in the evening. It is almost half seven. Um, so our staff meeting's just finished. So everyone's kind of just left. So this is the aftermath of the pizza. So we've got a lot of pizza now for me and Phil to have over the next couple of days. So he'll be happy that that's there because Phil's at work now so he can have that um, for when he gets home. But I think now I'm just going to clean all of this up, probably just chuck them in the dishwasher. Um, and then I might get another load of washing on because my sheets have finished. I think I might just eat it um, for the rest of the um, evening because I have a clothing haul that I want to get up next Monday? It's Monday the 12th day as I'm filming this. Next Monday the 19th is when I want to put up my clothing haul um, and I've already edited my vlog that I want to put up um, on Friday as well so I'm kind of alright at the moment for videos um, but I just want to start getting ahead um, just because I am still quite sick at the moment and because if I end up worse or I end up really tired with work um, then I've just got videos that I could put up. So not sure what time Phil's getting home but he started at half five so we'll see. Also the snacks went down really well so oh they cleaned out the 
sour cream and chives. Um, so just some salt and vinegars and then a couple of sour wounds and a couple of pineapple lumps. So definitely got the right amount, which I'm happy about because I was starting to second guess myself. And the after. So I've still got my glass of lemonade there, which I'm still finishing. But I have put everything away. I have washed the chopping boards that are in the sink. So now I've kind of rinsed everything and that glass is formed. That's right. Chucked it in the dishwasher. There's the pizza boxes there for Phil to take out for recycling. He took the other bags that were there as well out. Um, those are the sheets. I'm just letting them cool down before I put them away. Um, and then I've got another load on in the washer dryer, which you can't see because it's black. Um, but yeah, I've put the leftover pizza up there. I just feel so put together when I have a clean house. And especially when I'm sick, like it just feels nice to be in like a clean environment. Are you gonna come be in the last thing? It's a little bit later on now. Time is like 20 to 10. So as you can tell, Phil and I are in bed. There he is, he's home from work now. But I just wanted to come on here and just end the video because I've been good at that recently. So massive thank you to Phil for starting my video today. Mm. <laughs> so if you did like it, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Turn on the notifications, all the good stuff. Check out my social media, it's always linked in the description box below. Do you want to say anything, Phil? Mm. Give them some wise words of wisdom before we sign out. One piece of life advice. Find a good boss. There you go. Find a good boss. Find a job that you love and stick to it because life is too short to, to be doing... To deal with shit people. Yeah, to deal with shit people and to be in a job that you hate. If you feel like your job is toxic, leave because your mental health is more important than anything else. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Okay, well, we will see you in the next video. Goodbye, Phil. I have goodbye. Yeah. Goodbye. <laughs>